Good day, good people. Welcome to Good Talk. Demi here out of Tulsa, Oklahoma. When it's good, it's good. And the sunshine is good today, so get yourself some of that most definitely. The topic for today is soul food. Yes, not literally speaking, but spiritually speaking. What is going to feed the soul? That's what we want to get for you today. So we're going to start off first by loving ourselves. Love for self is a catalyst for not only loving others, but for loving the life that you live and being able to navigate through life. Anything that does not fall in line will fall away, most definitely. Next up, the bread of life. Being spiritually, spiritually balanced and spiritually grounded and connected. It is um, a very good practice to to be in line with the spirit, to know what's going on in your spirit so that you can move forward. Be honest with the person that you are and the person that you show up as. If you need work, get work. Do work. Improve the, yourself because being honest with who you are and starting from there is a great way to feed the soul. And except when you improve Accept that and celebrate it because you're better than you were yesterday. So that is an improvement and it does feed the soul. Last but not least is a good cry. Never underestimate the power of a good cry. It's It sounds like it's weak. It sounds like it's vulnerable, but it's actually strength by being able to be weak or being able to show vulnerability, then enough vulnerability to cry. To let those tears fall from your eyes is more of a cleansing type thing. You know, no story this week, but I did want to say this. The lion does not walk in the jungle and say that he is a lion, but he will show you, though. We appreciate you for joining us today here on Good Talk. We'll talk to you next time. The show is brought to you by Honey Butter Media. Inspire, uplift, transform. Welcome to Good Talk.